Welcome to Planet Earth, you sex. I am Xanthan, leader of the Wizard. You have been sent to Planet Earth for the single purpose of populating the land with our species. This superspecies will begin with your offspring. You have been programmed with a human disguise. Use this disguise to infiltrate and impregnate the other things. We will utilize your offspring for the means to take part together. The dwelling that you currently reside in contains a basement. This is where you must imprison the impregnated others until the birth of your offspring. An earthling body can only withstand one new pregnancy. After this birth, you must dispose of the earthling to retain ultimate secrecy. You must not be discovered, or the project will fail. Never reveal yourself to the earthlings. The future of our entire species depends on your success. Failure will not be tolerated. Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. My name's Nina and uh, I'm sorry to interrupt the video so soon. I've just been editing it and I've noticed how often I say the word erm. It's driving me insane while editing it. I think I was just so nervous about my first ever video but I promise you it does stop soon. It stops really soon. So in the meantime to entertain you I've popped a little counter up in this corner to count how many times I say erm. It's a few. I'm sorry. It stops soon. Back to the video. I'm going to do the alien invasion challenge by Little Miss Simmer. Um, I'll put the rules up of it on the screen, but uh, probably most of them were in that cutscene that I put at the beginning. Um, but the main goal of it is to impregnate female earthlings and then get every house in Oasis Spring with three aliens inside of it. So we're going to jump straight into it. This is Usax. Um, he does have a disguise, as mentioned by Xanthan in the video. Um, so we're going to pop in his disguise. So he has basically been created, he's been bred to be the ultimate Don Juan, the ultimate seducer of earthling women. Um, so he's got a pretty good disguise though, he's quite handsome. Um, and he goes by the name of Axel. He doesn't go by Usax, he goes by Axel when he's speaking to ladies. Um, so this is his house, this is his basement, so this is the, um, the spaceship that he was sent to Earth in. He's got to rebuild it though because it, it all just went crazy when he landed. So he's going to rebuild that. Um, once he's populated the Earth he'll go back to the home planet of Sixam. That's what he's going to do with that. He can also go visit I think, I think it'll be on the rules anyway. I'll check them up but I'm pretty sure you can go visit every so often. Um, so these are the cells, this is where we're going to be keeping our pregnant earthlings. Um, four should be enough I think, I think it should be enough for now anyway. <laughs> we're not even going to get somebody pregnant straight away I don't think, so we'll be alright with that for now. This here is our nursery, so this is where we're going to keep our um, little alien babies. So once we've got our babies we do have to kill the earthling, so that's going to be <laughs> unpleasant, but yeah we'll get it done. Uh, so Welcome Wagon is actually here, and there is, ooh, ooh, there is a lady amongst it. She could be our first victim. So what's her name? Yeah, Jaden? Jaden. So let's invite Jaden in. Invite Jaden in, and let's put this fruit cake over here. People can grab a slice of that. I just hate things being on the floor. I hate it when Sims just leaves to fall over the floor. So this is his pad to pad as well. Um, pad. I didn't make it. I'll put the person who did make it in the description box below because very talented. I couldn't make something like this. I tweaked it slightly, um, but yeah, most of it is the same. I just all I did was just put a bar in the back and a hot tub. Really, I think everything else is exactly the same. Uh, I obviously put the cellar in as well, so I just stuck that down there, but other than that, same. So let's see if we can chat up Jaden here, because um, we do want to get straight on with our mission. So let's chat her up and see if she likes us. Uh, he's a serial romantic as well and he does have some really good traits, so he is um, outgoing, romantic, he's non-committal com he's non-committal as well, so he is going to probably be girlfriend and boyfriend with the sims, but I don't think we'll get married to any of them, uh, because he is non-committal, I don't think he's going to go for that, but yeah, we're just going to chat up her. Uh, 
I'm just going to chat up Yolanda. Jaden. I'm going to chat up Jaden here. Um, and see if we can get on a good side. Because how good would it be to make friends and get romantic with somebody in the first part from the welcome wagon? From the welcome wagon. <laughs> So, these guys are just stood around. I do have, uh, I do have free will turned on. I don't know, they're just, I think they're just chilling. I don't, I don't know why they're there. So, don't worry, we'll get your fun filled up really soon if you know what I mean. This is such a cool challenge. So we're going to woohoo them. We're going to romance them now, actually. So we're going to woohoo them, make them pregnant, and oh, stay at home, mum. So she is already a mum, so we know that she's good for it. <laughs> we know she's good for it. So yeah, I think, what was I saying? I was saying something about, um, yeah, we'll move them in, I think. We'll move them in once, uh... Once we're friends with them. In fact, oh my god, that filled up really fast. Is that because he's an alien? He's got no skills, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, Charisma 1. I've never played with an alien before. Um, I've got a few mods in, by the way. Not to raise Charisma or anything that much, though. I, d I don't know why. It's gone up so fast. Uh... I'm not complaining. I, it must be an alien thing because I haven't got a mod that does that. So, um, yeah, let's let's go into it. But yeah, I do have a few mods. I do have Slice of Life, um, so that's in there. It's it's really good. I do recommend that. Um, so if you see a few sort of mood that's going on down here, like the pinks in the cheeks as well when they get flirty, that's all from Slice of Life. It's really, really good. Um, also, that thing there where it said he's discovered something new about himself, that's a mod. So we can go in and see what he's discovered about himself. He's going on a discovery journey about his life. So he loves family-oriented sims. That'll be handy. That'll be handy, guys. Not that they're going to have much of a hand in raising... Um, in raising the children, but... Oh, she's married. Oh, she doesn't like it. She doesn't like it. Stop. Uh, she is married. But do you know what? He's an alien. So, he doesn't really care about that stuff. He's come here for a mission. He's come here on a mission. He's going to impregnate the earthlings. That's... I think these, I don't know, I don't know which mod it is, but I think these just pop up. Anyway, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to say we're not allowed to try for a baby or woohoo or anything until we're girlfriend and boyfriend with them. So we're going to first kiss. We're going to get that first kiss in. I can't believe this has happened so quickly. Yay, this has happened so quickly. So ask her to be girlfriend and if she accepts then we're allowed to try for a baby with her. <laughs> oh, snurks. Jaden has discovered that you sax blue is an alien not even trying to hide it. I am trying to hide it actually. I am trying to hide it. So what we need to do, she's not allowed to leave the lot now. We have to move her in. Which we were gonna do anyway. Why can't we move her in? Oh, she doesn't like it. Stop, stop, stop. Stop, stop, stop. You're going to take someone's eye out. Whatever you're doing, it's not working. Um, what? No, 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 no. No, 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 no. No. Why can't we move her in? Uh, oh, is it because Welcome Wagon... Oh, sorry. <laughs> is it because Welcome Wagon is going on? Sorry, she's banging on the table. Um, let's see. Can we move her in now? Where's friendly introductions? That uh, asked to move in. Gee. It's because Welcome Wagon was going. They can all leave. Yeah, they can all just leave. Yeah, we should probably go. Welcome again. Thanks, guys. 
but we're probably never gonna see you again because do you know what? You're not women, so <laughs> we can't impregnate you. Um, ooh, Yolanda. I said Yolanda earlier, didn't I? I must be psychic. I must be absolutely psychic. So I think that must be her daughter or sister. She's fair game anyway. She's fair game. We might have to, you know. Got to see her later. Right, so she's moved in. What we're going to do now is we're going to try for a baby. And hope that she gets pregnant. She's got a bad reputation. Ooh, she's a clubber and she's family orientated and glutton. They're a bit of a strange variety of traits, aren't they? So she's family orientated, but she's a clubber. I suppose what she does in her spare time is uh, it's fine. Oh, look at these messy people. They didn't even clean up their plates after themselves. It's just rude. That's the last time I invite them round. Not that we were going to anyway. So break out the candles, make it romantic. Usax and Jaden are woo-wee for the first time. I don't know what this is. This is universal for bam chicka wow wow. So this is the first time he's actually ever wooed. And it's for a mission. I don't think he's complaining, but it is for a mission. So let's speed on through anyway and see if she's pregnant. Cross your fingers and toes. Cross your fingers and toes. What is she wearing? <laughs> cross your fingers, cross your toes. Oh, let's do that again. We're just gonna keep doing it until she's uh, pregnant. I think is what we're gonna do. There's no sink in here. There's no sink in here. I bet it's because um, of this little thing. Because of that little thing, it's, it's, it's gone. What have we got in the inventory? We don't need that. Um, we need a sink, is what we need. So we'll get this one. And we need to put it on the surface. Oh, can't type. We're going to put it here and get rid of move objects because I can't stand having it on. Oh god, I can't type. Move objects. Right, that's that sorted. Um, so with the slice of life as well, you do have to drink. So we'll have to get some water later, otherwise you get dehydrated and stuff. Discovered, they saw through my clever disguise. Overheating. He's very, very flirty. Are you going to try for a baby or not? You're not allowed to leave the lock, Missy, because you're not allowed to tell people who we are. You're not allowed to tell people we are alien. No, no, no. No, no, no. What does he keep discovering about himself? My god, my godness. Like, godness. He has not discovered anything new about himself. He's, he's just tripping. He's just absolutely, he's absolutely tripping. So he's doing it again. It's happening. It's happening again. And then we're gonna take a pregnancy test. Let them finish, Nina. Let them finish. Eager beaver over here. Right. Um. Oh my. We're just gonna keep doing it. We're just gonna keep doing it. Can't let her leave because maybe, maybe if if she, if she can't do it this time, we'll we'll try in the we'll try in the hot tub. We all know that the hot tub. Uh, is the best place to try for a baby. <laughs> right, come on. Come on. Come on, Jaden. Right, have I got another toilet? I think I've just got one. But I'm gonna clean these up because dirty, horrible sims. Dirty, horrible sims. And then he can go cook something for his new girlfriend. You sex, you are useless. You're gonna... He can, oh, no, no. He can cook a grand meal. He can cook a grand meal, but he can't cook whatever this was, scrambled eggs. He 
can't cut scrambled eggs on toast. <laughs> can't make eggs on toast. Who can't make eggs on toast? Just, just take a pregnancy test. Will you stop getting stuff out of the fridge that he can't cook? Because it's just a waste of food. Right, come over here and serve up your beautiful new girlfriend. Ooh! Ah, oh, what's this? She's eating for two. She's eating for two. And her. Who is she? Is she sister? Sister? Or. Oh, she's a teen. Well, at least we've got one girl pregnant in this episode. We're going to lock her up down here and then we're going to come over here and be like, can I help you? Um, I really don't know. I really don't know who you're looking for. I've never heard of Jaden. No, no. Well, she's going to be like, I've heard of you now. <laughs> you must have heard of her. She, I've just walked straight past her. I can explain. Um, she's she's just come over. She uh, she's, she's in her pajamas for no reason, and I'm in my boxes for no reason. I do have the mod where you can make teeth yes, pregnant. No. I don't so really want to though. So. We are going to make friends with her though. We're just going to be like, you know what? Um, ah, it was just real. a one night stand. Your mum's gone now. So, it is a mum, isn't it? Let's have a look at a family she, she doesn't like. Cause she's like, how dare you break up my family? How dare you? So she, yeah, she is daughter. I really wish she was the sister. <laughs> Yips. Right, we're gonna have to do it. We're just gonna have to be brutal. We are an alien. We don't care about these earthlings and their feelings. So we're just gonna be like, you know, it's all right. She hates us. She hates us. Give Could you imagine? You've just walked into somebody's house. You've seen your mum in her pajamas. You've seen the guy in his boxes. And then he starts giving you relationship advice. Logic. Logic. She doesn't know we're a human at least. So let's not give it away. And let's just keep on trying to be friends with her. We'll try and flirt. We'll, tr we'll try a sexy pose. We'll try a sexy pose. Hopefully it'll woo her over. It's not. It's not wooed her over. He's a bit screwed. He's, oh. Oh. She liked something that we just did. She, she liked something that we just did. So maybe don't embrace. That, that's a little bit too much too soon. Does she know? Does she know that we've just wooed her mother, impregnated her, and then locked her up in a basement? Does she know? She doesn't look like she knows. She doesn't look like she knows. Or she just doesn't care. We're gonna just schmooze her to death. And we're gonna just lay it on thick. Don't leave. Don't leave. Please don't leave. Please don't leave me. You... This is so bad. But he has a mission and he's going to complete it. He's been bred for one purpose. Stop, stop being grumpy. Don't be grumpy. And why are you fill filling up so quick? She's jealous. She's a kleptomaniac. Don't steal anything from our house. Or I'll be really mad at you. She, she, she seems to be liking it and she doesn't seem to be liking it. So we're going to go in for the first kiss and hope that she accepts. Why is this? Why are we getting sort of, so that must have been from the previous. We were getting the negative um, interactions, but I think that must have been from the previous. So we have first kissed her. We are going to embrace her. 
and just schmooze it and lay it on thick and can we uh invite to stay the night yeah we're gonna do that we're gonna try for a baby with her mother and daughter locked up down here in the basement she's um she's coping well she's she's enjoying her predicament i think look at those rosy cheeks she's she's happy to be locked up down here she's uh not bothered at all sleepover sounds great so we are going to um we have to ask the girlfriend ask to be girlfriend before we can woohoo so i think what we're going to do is can we ask her to move in yet can can we no we're going to hug her um why can't we ask her to move in is it oh it'll be because she's a teen can we age her up this is this is what we have to do guys this is what we're just we're just gonna have to do it we're gonna have to age her up oh no wrong person you please so he's gonna cook this cake and he's gonna steal a slice isn't it? this happens in every single one of my games every single one they cook a cake and then they steal the slice and then you have to cook another cake and then somebody else steals the slice and then you've got to cook another cake and then it's just an endless circle add birthday candles add birthday candles quickly add birthday candles please success We've just won the game. <laughs> we have just won the game. To get birthday candles on the cake is like the whole point of The Sims. So we're gonna age her up. She um, is coming over here. She's gonna age up. And then what we're gonna do is we're going to move her in and have our second oh, yeah. victim. Oh, we haven't even left the house yet. No. We're doing really well. So. Thanks for singing happy birthday to, to her. So move her in. Move her in and woohoo her. Get her pregnant. Stick her down in the cellar with cellar. We call cellar in England. We call it cellar. Basement. Move her into the basement. And job done. Two victims. One day. Say that's a success. I'd say uh, that's a pretty good success. So is she a girlfriend? Yeah, is she... She knows we're an alien, doesn't she? Did she find out we were an alien? No, she just knew that we were with the mum. So can we ask her to be our girlfriend now? Oh, he keeps discovering new stuff about himself. Um, so be our girlfriend? Please? Is she already? Did we ask already? I can't remember. Oh no, I just don't think we're high enough up yet in um, in our relationship with her. So we need we need to just be really good friends, I think, first. So really lay it on there. Schmooze away. Uh, come on, come on, come on. Speed, speed, speed. Is our friend? Speed is our friend. Who are you? Can we kill? How do we kill a vampire? Because they'll they'll still starve, won't they? They'll run out of plasma. Um. So we can we can still. Should we go and say hi, or do you think this chick's just gonna be like? We're gonna focus on one at a time. We'll do. We'll focus on one at a time for now. So, we're asking her to be our girlfriend. I'm going straight for the bed. Did you see that? I'm going straight for the bed. I'm like, oh, bed. Uh, oh. oh, I thought she'd rejected us. So, they are boyfriend and girlfriend now. So, that means we can try for a baby. I'm chicka wow wow. Wonderful. Good stuff. Go on, go on. I don't know why it keeps saying negative stuff, but they don't seem to be falling out and I don't know what's going on there anyway we're going to do some rumpty pumpty and see hopefully hopefully she's pregnant this is so sick so we've got the mother pregnant and now we're getting the daughter pregnant 
he's an alien. He doesn't really, he doesn't really understand the family ties. Second victim. Second victim. We're going to stick her down here with the mum. They can keep each other company. They have to be in separate cells though. Uh, just because I say so. How pregnant are you? How pregnant are you already? I hope it's twins. I really hope it's twins. Could you imagine if the mum and the daughter had twins? That would be amazing. So I think what we're going to do is we're going to end it here. We've got two victims already. We've got two women pregnant. So that's two babies at least. Two plus two is four. Minus one, that's three. Quick maths. We're doing well because we're going to have to fill each house with three babies. So we're like... How many houses is that? Yeah, it's, it's begun. We've made a start. So I'm going to wrap it up here. And in the next episode, I think we're going to get him out of the house because there's going to come a time where we've got lots of babies and we're not going anywhere. Not going to go anywhere. So I'm going to say bye to you and see you in the next part. Bye. Ooh, 21 pounds.